I'm Master Ferdinand from Sri Lanka. I'm presently seated in the compound of one of my students with a lot of fruit trees around me. You can see there's a lot of flora. I would like to today discuss the poem Elena Rigby. It is known as a poem of loneliness, of a lonely people. When one looks at this poem, it is a poem which will stand the test of time. It fits into any era. It shows how lonely people can be even if one is in a developed city like New York or London, anywhere. When one thinks of Elena Rigby, we can say she is a woman who is living in a world of make-believe, especially when she picks rice in a church. There may be many definitions given to her. One of the definitions I give to it is she may have been thinking of the day she walked down the aisle to make her marriage vows and how her marriage went on the rocks. And she may have been thinking of the saying, marriages fail not because they are made in heaven, but because they are made by frail human beings. And most of the time she picks rice in the church. Maybe at times she may have been sitting in one of the pews and thinking of the saying, marry in haste and repent at leisure and may have been finding solace to the chimes of Ave Maria, which would have been ringing in the church bells. When one thinks of Father Mackenzie, he too is a lonely man. He dances his socks in the night when there is no one. He may have been humming the hymn, What a Friend We Have in Jesus, while humming, while uh, darning his socks. And it is said that he used to write his notes or his sermons where no one is to come and listen. Still, he was the only man who stood by Elena Rigby, or in the end he was the only man who did the final rites of him. And in the poem one can see that he dusts his hands and comes out after doing the final rites. When one reads the section dusting the dust from his hands, one can see Christ on the altar living in Father Mackenzie which is very rare today. The Beatles have done a beauty of a song of it and bringing out the real loneliness of people. With these thoughts, I will close.